The leader of the Scottish Liberal Democrats, Willie Rennie, has defended his party's change of policy over Brexit. The Lib Dems now say if they form the next UK government, they'll stop Brexit by revoking Article 50 without a referendum. Critics argue it's hypocritical to prevent a vote on Brexit while saying such a thing must happen over Scottish independence. Our political correspondent David Porter is at the Liberal Democrats conference in Bournemouth for us now. David, what's the mood there among delegates? I think it's fair to say they are pretty chipper at the moment. Liberal Democrats feel that their political star is in the ascendancy. Over the past few months, they've had some notable election victories in local elections, the European elections, and they've also won a by-election, plus the fact over the last few weeks they have had a number of high-profile um, defections to the party. They also feel that they now have a clear stance on Brexit. They are against it. They say that if they were to become the next government at Westminster, and that is a very big if, they would revoke Brexit and they would cancel Article 50. That has led to some calls of hypocrisy by their political opponents saying, well, if you're going to rule out a vote on Brexit, what would happen if there was a second independence referendum on Scotland? What would happen in those circumstances? Would you say no vote on Brexit, but there has to be a second vote on Scottish independence? This afternoon, Willie Rennie was asked that question. He believes the two issues are very different. We are proposing to have the status quo. We're proposing to stop Brexit. Governments can do that. If we get a massive mandate for a majority Liberal Democrat government, that will be a pretty big signal that the country's had enough of Brexit and we stop it. If you're arguing for big bang constitutional change that the SNP are arguing, of course you need to have the democratic underpinning of a vote, a referendum. That's what they should be arguing for. I'm against it. I want to stop independence and I want to stop Brexit. But it hasn't all been plain sailing for the Liberal Democrats in Scotland today, David. No, it hasn't. A uh, gentleman by the name of Galen Mill was the Westminster parliamentary candidate for Banff and Buchan. I stress was. He made some comments on social media about Boris Johnson and other senior Tory MPs saying they should be hung, drawn and quartered. He has now been sacked for that. Doesn't those seem to have worried the Conservatives? Jacob Rees-Mogg, who was attacked by Mr Milne, has said that as the President of the Council, I don't need to be hung, drawn and quartered. I have the privilege of being beheaded. David in Bournemouth, thank you.